Hey guys, it's Nina, and I'm gonna show you how I choose to and twist my locks. It took me forever to learn for some reason, but now that I've got it, it's just a quick and easy style to do when I don't feel like being bothered with my locks. So if you're interested, keep watching. Before I start, I just wanna send a shout out to my sisters. We went as Kiss for Halloween this weekend to a party, and we won first place, and it was just a dope experience. I just think that we killed this look, and this was the first time I put a wig over my locks, and I just really felt like a rock star for the night. So yeah, shout out to them and back to our program. So I'm starting with my locks straight. And as you can see, I already did one in the back. I'm using the Allocay Naturals Lemongrass Leave-In Conditioner for moisture. And I'm just gonna spray that on my hair in sections and work it through. So I take a section of four locks. I normally would like the ends to be the same length, but that's not always possible. So starting about an inch or so from the root, I split the four locks in half, and then I twist each section around itself, and then I twist the sections together. I don't know if that makes sense, but basically you're twisting and then twisting. So twist the individual sections and then twist them together. And then the twist is pretty much done. And then I just secure it with a little rubber band. Now some people tuck their ends in and that is a much neater look than what I'm doing. But I did this style one other time with my ends tucked. And when I took the twist down, I did not like how bent my ends were. So for me, this is gonna have to do. So I'll show you another section. You wanna make sure you keep your wrists flowing. It's all about the wrist action when you're twisting. And also, you don't want it to get too tight on your roots. If you're noticing that your roots are getting really tight as you're doing this, definitely loosen up the twist. I also have not tried this on soaking wet locks. I've only done it after my locks have been dried and I just sprayed water or um, some of the leave-in spray on them. So I'd like to see how this goes when my locks are very wet. I'm gonna finish the rest and I'll be back. And here we have it. Now these edges still need some tending too, but the twists are done. And here's the back. Now some of them in the middle, I kind of would have preferred to have parted them slightly differently, just so there's a little bit less scalp in the middle. But this is also a really low key, low maintenance style for me, so I'm not gonna sweat the small stuff, you dig? And just to give it a little something, I'm taking some of the locks in the front and pulling them towards the back. Just something simple. I am sure there is a much more sophisticated way to do this, but this is what I'm doing right now, okay? Cause I ain't going nowhere. So I'm out here representing for the sisters with the short edges. If you got short edges, can I get a like on this video? Thank you. <laughs> so I'm just smoothing them down with a brush and some water. And then I'm using the Curls Blueberry Bliss to smooth them down as much as they will possibly go because they really don't like to be smoothed down, okay? And then I just tie my hair up with a scarf to lay things down as much as possible. And that's it, ladies and gents. That is my two strand twist style. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. If you haven't done so, please hit that bell so you know when I upload. Let me know if you have any questions because I know it can be kind of hard to explain this because um, it took forever for me to figure it out. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.